I think it's really about to happen. It's really about to happen. Gidro's about to run the fucking set with Fudo. Now check me out, everybody. Last week episode, we literally had Carol. Carol body Noble Red. The girls getting their X drives. Hibiki utilizing the amalgam once again. And to top it all off, we finally get Miku getting another Sifo gear. Now that she's possessed by the Shimha. Bro, what the fuck? Yo, sign a lot of things happened. A lot of things happened. And don't get me fucking started with those previews. When I saw those previews Friday, bruh. Okay, we got Akira. Akira Tachibana is making another combat. Now, I'm just saying this. Akira, look, bro. I'm, I, before I start the episode, Akira, look here. Bro, do not make me hate you more than Fudo right now, okay? Hibiki needs you right now. So Fuck no, baby. So if Hibiki talking to Akira about her situation, I hope this man is encouraging her to follow her own path. Because right now, I don't need to hate another father. The fact that this episode is called I Am a Father, son, Fudo is about to reveal everything. Legit. I am fucking hype. I see Genjiro in the preview. He look like he about to throw hands. It's about that fucking time. So with all that being said, you guys already know. Yo, Sakita, play that intro. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? They can't be doing this. They showing season one. All the interactions they had in season one, they can't do this. That's that shit. Yo, when they had their first fight, yo. What the fuck? There we go, set phone gear G, GX, AXZ. Yo, you got a lot of fans crying right now about the situation at hand. Don't be doing this, y'all. Yo. Bro, why is she talking like she can't bring her back? Okay, I don't like how they have Hibiki talking like they can't bring Miku back. Yo, what? Like, yo, what's up with this foreshadowing? So is Miku really not coming back after all this? Yo, this, yo, this better not be true. What the fuck? This better not be true. Dead ass. Yo, yo. This, yo, this better not be true. <laughs> what the fuck? Yo, this time skip. Wow, we already got to Acura already? But see, Biki sleeping over at her father's house? This man, Acura is like, yo, the struggle is real, bro. This is the apartment. <laughs> oh, yeah, so she is under house arrest because they never found about the amalgam ability. Damn, that's that shit. <laughs> wow. Wait, so she cannot, can't, so she had to stay with her dad? She can't go back to her place? <laughs> there you go! That's what I wanted! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! He's doing- This was what I wanted. When I saw Akira, I was like, bro, this nigga better not bring no bad vibes. Yo, ooh, thank you, he's being a fucking father. Let's go. Let's go! This is what I wanted. Oh! What the hell? She already lost her Siphon Gear ability? Yo, is Miku about to body all of them? Oh, sh I think she's worrying. At, at the Yo! No, he still got control of Subasa! What the? Tsubasa, what are you doing? Yo, she's under control! No. What the hell, Tsubasa? What's going on? Chaos. Wow, so she fused both the thousand the thousand rains along with her shadow at the time? Oh shit. Tsubasa, what are you doing? So this is what he been waiting for. This is literally what Fudo been waiting for. This fuck this guy Fudo, bro. He waited. He waited. This is what he been waiting for. Yo, fuck this nigga Fudo, bro. Like, yo, people tell me, yo, everybody chill off on Fudo. Fuck Fudo. I didn't like him since he got first revealed in this goddamn series. 
This nigga's trash. I mean, at least she don't stay in her cell phone gear form. How did you create it? He created a cell phone gear? The false robe of the Senso Jin? What the fuck? So it's not a cell phone gear. It was a false robe? What the fuck? How? You must become a monster for the sake of your... What? Yo, Subasa, do not listen to this dude. Do not listen to this dude. Break free already. Fuck, bro. Yo, they about to ring this place. Yo, Gendro, please tell me you're going with Maria. Please tell me you're going with Maria. Throw the fucking hands, dog. Please tell me you're going. If necessary, you are permitted to use lethal force. Oh, Subasa? Fucking ride or die! Yes, Maria! I realized about halfway through. A guy like me. Ah, oh, this nigga. You should have said something, Akira. At least think of something, bro. Yo, they really bought the raid, the Kazanari Mansion. This is OD! Yo, let me let me in this bitch. Access denied. Oh, approved. Okay. This nigga already got the noise with him. What the hell? Oh, snap. All right, Maria. Already in action. Let's go. Okay, so Maria and all the girls can't use the amalgam. It's not just Hibiki. Thank you. But I wonder when they're going to utilize them. There's that nigga. Arrest that nigga! Arrest that nigga! Yo! 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 Run the fucking hands! 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 Let's go! This nigga using a sword against a fucking fist? Let's go! Yo! Gendro! Oh! And there goes Subasa. Uh-oh. Oh, man. Is that... Oh, snap. No parade is out there, too? Let's go. Okay. Ooh. Uh-huh. Let's go. Okay. Okay, Subasa becoming a Beyblade is helping you out. I see that. Red Bloom because they're weak, hot, arrogant. Wow. Oh! She broke it! Maria broke it, yes! Yo, let's go. Gendro, run. Oh, he took the coat. Yo, let's get it. Run the fucking hands, bro. Run it. Let's go. Oh, oh, let's go. Let's fucking. Oh, let's fucking go. Yo. Let's go. Let's go. Fuck that sword. Run the hands. 1v1. Please tell me he got it. What the fuck? No! Get your out! No, 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 no! Not the suplex! No! You're on a rock! Oh, bro. Fuck, man! That's the same!
same spot Fine hit him at. That's that shit, bro. Damn. That's that shit. Fuck, man. This nigga, this nigga Fudo did the fucking Falcon drop on this man. I'm hurt. Ooh. Maria! Oh, I thought you were about to. I thought you were about to stab Maria. Oh no! It got broken. It got broken, nigga. You can't control her no more, nigga. What? What the fuck? <laughs> Bruh! Bruh, Fudo! Fudo! Yo, he's not dead, bro. Come on. Come on, he's not dead. Don't do this. He's not dead, bro. Come on. He's not dead. He's not dead, bro. Why Subasa got a fucked up family, bro? Come on, dog. Come on, Subasa. Please fuck this man up. You got the power. Fuck the rules. This nigga Fudo has gone. Too far. He needs to be stopped right now. Subasa mind is cleared. She knows what she need to do. She need to take Fudo down. If she can't do it, man, look here. That man gotta go. Let this nigga Fudo knows the power of your song. Go, Subasa. Fuck this old nigga up. That's it. Let's go. Fuck him up. Let's go. Get that shit out of my face, Fudo. What the fuck? That demonic ass power. What? I mean, what the hell? Even Gidro can do that to the girls. What the fuck? What the fuck? Who? Come on, Subasa, you got this! Come on, Subasa! Come on! Bro, please let her use the amalgam. Maria! I know Maria came through. I know Maria came through. <gasps> she using the amalgam! She got the approval! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Yo! 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 Yo, this shit look dope! Holy shit! Yo! <laughs> Fuck your blade! Go in, Subasa! Give him all your anger! Let this man know! What the fuck? Nah. Nah. Take him down! Let's go! Gidro! Subasuka! Wait, what is that? Wait, is that Miku? Is that what Miku been doing? Underground the whole time? It's Miku. What does she do? You better say some good shit. It's a lot of this.
I'm a bad dad who can't do anything for you. Heki <laughs> hechala. <laughs> Yo, that's the best thing this man can say right now. I said by this time next year, everyone will be quoting me. <laughs> Let's relax. <laughs> time to see if there's something at the end. What the fuck? The moon. Yo. Yo, what if Fine's in there? Like, low key. What if Fine's in there, low key? <laughs> nah, nah. Nah, I'll reach it. I'll reach it. But Fine gotta show herself one time. Because there's no way they're gonna put Fine in the opening of this season. And she has not been brought up yet. I feel like Fide is going to come. I feel like Fide is going to come. But yo, bruh, bruh, thank you. Thank you. This man finally says something right. He's actually so changed. Like, I, I, no, no, I just want to get accurate out the way because he didn't really do much. But to the fact that at the end, he came up and said, yo, hey, ki he chala. Like, bro, these are the words. That made Hibiki what she is today. The fact that her optimistic attitude is always so empowered. Like, bro. I'll, I'll give you this, Sakura. You actually did something right. You know, G GX, when we saw the past and whatnot, and how you was being a coward. Okay. You was kind of you was kind of a fucking dork. Okay. You a loser. I'm a follow. Worthless. But you know what? XV, you did, have the, you did not have the right choice of words. But I will say this. I'm glad. That you understood your experience from GX and you just, you know, you managed to somewhat empower your daughter in XV. So, you know what? Akira, Akira, I'll give him that. He did a good job this season. I'll give him that. I will give him that. This nigga Fudo went too far. Like, he legit went too far. I don't know why Genjiro saved him. Like, really, Fudo needed to be stopped. He really needed to be stopped. But I understand what Genjiro was trying to do. He don't want Subasa ending up like he don't want Subasa or basically any other gear users to just to resort to killing somebody, especially a human. Like, but fuck, man, this man Fudo, he needs to be stopped, bro. Look, if the girls don't kill Fudo, I'm pretty sure the Shimha is gonna kill Fudo because Fudo right now he's just playing like a villain. But I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure, the Shimha that's controlling Miku is about to take his own action. I'm pretty sure Fudo is just a pawn right now because literally whatever is happening with Miku and then the ending credit showcasing the freaking moon. Yo, I feel like the girls might have to go to the moon as well, but he went too far. I understand. Tsubasa should become a monster and just straight up kill Fudo. But fuck, bro. The fact that Fudo killed her brother who was supposed to be her father. Like, bro, Fudo is the most trashest character in here. Like, yo, Akira, he finally showcased his improvement. Cool. But fucking Fudo. I didn't like Fudo since day one. I never liked him. I never liked him. He came through. He just talked this shit, but he don't do nothing. You know, I'm kind of glad that, you know, this episode, we see a little bit of Fudo skills or whatnot. This nigga's literally on some JoJo shit. But, nah, like... I do not like the fact that, you know, bruh, like, I don't understand, bro. Like, bruh, damn. I, don't, I, I just can't believe this man actually killed his son. Like, what the fuck? Like, this man gotta have life. He, he needs to have a life sentence. Again, I feel like Fudo's gonna get killed, though. Not by the girls, but most likely the Shimha or whatever is the real main antagonist I, i'm still 50 50 about who's the real main antagonist here because it's like okay we got fudo and then we got the shimha that's possessing miku and i'm pretty sure the shimha like the god is pretty much gonna do his own thing and then you got noble red noble red pretty much got one shot it by the shimha so i don't even know what happened to them i really feel like noble red is going to get a power up because what happened in that goddamn opening when the shadows pretty much you know was around them i feel like that's going to be the power up they get i don't know that's just what that's just the little speculation i always had but i'm pretty sure 
they're gonna get a power up. And to the fact that Subasa finally utilized the amalgam, and they also got the approval to utilize the amalgam, I cannot wait to see what the other girl's amalgam is gonna look like. I'm, I'm still hoping, still hoping that Subasa has an amalgam with fucking yo, like bruh, the same way. How freaking he beaky had freaking Saint Germain. I want Subasa to have fucking Kanati. That's all I want. That's all I want. That's that's legit all I want right now. Even though it was short, this made my fucking day. This made my fucking day. I told y'all day one. I want Ginjiro to have the same highlight as big as him going up against Fine. And it happened. I'm happy. I'm happy. This season is so fucking dope, bro. Like, yo, this shit is so fucking dope. Seiji was getting a spotlight. Freaking Ginjiro's getting spotlight. Yo, this, yo, fuck, man. Freaking, yo. Even freaking Ayomi and freaking uh, Sakio was getting their own moments every now and then. But, yo, this is what I wanted. I, I'm still kind of mad how this man got one shot in the gut, similar to how he got one shot in by Fine. But it's like, Ginjiro still put in that fucking work. And the fact that he came back even after getting Falcon dropped. On a goddamn boulder. That's OD. That's OD. But I I, I don't know what's going to happen now. I, I'm pretty sure that the girls are literally going to have to go to the moon. Or whatever is happening on the moon is going to come towards the earth. I don't know. Because right now the Shima is pretty much somewhat being controlled by Fudo. But I'm pretty sure the Shima is going to do its own thing. And the fact that damn. So yeah the Seiso G. Is the story like the relic is the story because that's something I was trying to figure out what was going on in freaking uh, episode 8. So Fudo basically said, Hey, yo, the relic of it is gone, so I made a Faust robe of it. Well, I didn't really make a Faust robe of it, I just stole it from the person that made it. Now, I want to know who the fuck made the Faust robe of the C So Jing. So, is, is that like mm, now? I'm curious, is there a Faust robe version of like the Gunnier? The Amino Habakiri, the Ichiban, like all the other Relic users, like is there a Faust Roll version of it? Because that's interesting as hell. I'm not even gonna friend. Huh. That's a lot of speculation. I'm pretty sure y'all gonna tell me in the comment section. You know, we go we gonna talk it out. I still gotta look through freaking episode eight. I'm sorry you guys I didn't go through the comment section and hear what you guys gotta say. A lot has been going on, especially since you know Florida got a hurricane. But I'm glad I was able to to do this reaction because I don't know what's gonna happen so I'm gonna do my best to hurry up and drop this for you guys but uh, I'm gonna stop right here cause I'm pretty sure the video is going as long as it is right now and I'm pretty sure you guys want me to stop rambling but yeah the next episode I don't know what else could happen but I'm just happy that everything happened that I wanted Ginjiro finally ran the fucking fade with Fudo he didn't win he didn't win but he ran the fucking fade R.I.P. To Subasa's father slash biological brother, even though Fudo is her actual father. Yo, I, I don't know, man. To this day, that still fucked me up. This man Fudo's like, I want an heir to the Kazunari family. So, I'ma fuck my son's wife, and boom, bam, Subasa came out. Like, what the fuck? Who does that? Her family is so fucked up. Her family is so fucked up. I feel bad for Subasa. The fact that she had to fight Maria. And I'm glad Maria was able to break that fucking control that Fudo had under her. So, again, I'm going to stop rambling. Uh, hit the like button if you guys enjoyed this video or whatnot. Um, damn, I don't know what else I got to say. Subscribe if you guys enjoy the content on this channel. Basically, uh, I got to get back to doing Sinfo Gear, other stuff besides just reaction or whatnot. Actually, I got to do a lot of shit. Oh, my God. I got to get back to streaming. But uh, with all that being said, this is me, boy. Total Oblivion. I'm signing out. Peace. Push me to the